With the Bloxy 2.0.59 update, we have introduced a new Shop Extra module for our Bloxy Pro customers. The Stock Scarcity module lets you create a sense of urgency for your customers when a product might be running low on stock. This is a great incentive for your shoppers to purchase more, as the fear of missing out phenomena really works on the shopper psyche. Before we continue, please note that the Shop Extra extension and its modules are available to our Bloxy Pro customers on the professional or agency plan. Okay, let's get started. To find the stock scarcity module, navigate to the WordPress dashboard, choose Bloxy on the left, then select the extensions tab. Choose Shop Extra and at the bottom, you'll find the module ready to be activated. Its configuration is very simple to understand and it already works with the stock management features of WooCommerce, so half the setup is done already. Once the module is activated, you will find a new pane in the customizer, WooCommerce, general section. The first option to note here is the stock threshold. In a nutshell, this option lets you set when the low stock alert shows up on the website. If the stock of a product falls below the value set here, the low stock alert displays on the archive and singular product pages. More on that in a second. The second option refers to the incentive message that's going to show up for users. You can customize this with any message you want. You can also use the cursive brackets items parameter to show the number of units remaining in stock for that specific product. The final option, bar height, lets you customize the look of the progress bar that appears when the module activates for a specific product. It is a simple visual cue that counts down the units in stock for that product. Pretty simple to configure, don't you think? Now we've talked about how to configure the module, but what about showing the alert on the website? The module behaves as a standard element for products, archive cards, and single product page elements. To find the element for the product archive page, go to the product archives, card options pane. Notice the stock scarcity element, which can be toggled with the little eye icon. Once enabled, it appears nicely on the product archive page. Next is the single product page. Navigate to the single product, product elements pane. The same stock scarcity element shows up here with the little icon that toggles its visibility. Naturally, it also appears nicely on the single product page. One more thing before we close out. The stock scarcity threshold is not required to work on a global level. This means that for each product that has its independent stock setting set up, the module will respect those. Let's take a quick look at this in action. If you have been paying attention to the details, you might have seen a product that has a slightly different progress bar for the remaining stock. Let's edit it really quick to see how things have been set up. The part that you may want to check out is the per product inventory settings further down the page. As you can see, the threshold here has been set to 25 and the stock scarcity module respects it. To demonstrate, we'll set the threshold to 100 and save the product. And sure enough, the scarcity message has fully disappeared from the front end. That's rather cool, right? A simple but powerful way to increase your conversion rates by creating a sense of urgency for your customers. Urgency is of the essence. And if you wish to learn more about what Bloxy2 has to offer, continue on onto our website or click on one of our other videos to keep watching.